Thank you for your interest in high power air gap style connectors. In this video, we will show you how to properly handle air gap connectors and the things to avoid. We start with a brief description of air gap connectors. For high power applications, standard fiber connectors cannot handle high powers. Instead, air gap connectors are used. In an air gap style connector, the fiber overhangs a few millimeters in the gap section of the connector ferrule. The back of the ferrule supports the fiber. The fiber tip can be flush with the ferrule end face or slightly recessed. The fiber tip is very fragile and extreme care must be taken when handling air gap style connectors. The smaller the fiber is, the easier it is to damage it. Hitting, touching, or dropping air gap connectors are to be avoided. When inspecting the connector or assembling the connector in a system, it is important not to hit the connector end face on the surface of the connector adapter while inserting it. The fiber tip will get scratched or broken. The best and safer way to insert an air gap connector into a connector adapter is by slightly tilting it at an angle. Once the side of the ferrule touches the hole of the adapter, the connector axis is aligned with the hole and pushed forward. Touching accidentally the fiber end face against the skin, glove, or the surface of a connector cap might either break the fiber or contaminate the fiber tip. Any contamination of the fiber tip must be avoided as it will burn and damage the fiber under high power. Dropping an air gap connector from some height will cause a shock that may break the fiber. This is especially true for smaller size fibers. Cleanliness of the fiber end face is very important for high power applications. To keep the fiber end face clean and to reduce risk of contamination when stored, metal caps must be used at all times instead of plastic or rubber caps. Plastic and rubber caps will outgas over time and can contaminate the fiber end face. New metal caps must be washed and cleaned before use to remove any contaminants inside them. Once removed from the connector tip, metal caps must be kept in a clean and dust-free area to stay clean for reuse. Finally, high-power air gap connectors should be handled in a very clean environment such as a clean room or a laminar flow bench. Only in these controlled environments will contamination of the fiber end face be reduced to a minimum or eliminated. For more information about high-power air gap style connectors, please visit our website at www.ozoptics.com slash products slash highpower.html.